and I found this, which I'm pretty sure is an agate and a rather large one at that. <laughs> oh yeah, it's definitely an agate. Now I just gotta figure out how to get it out of the ground. What's up, rock hounds? It's Alex and Kip. Today, we are out on the Yellowstone River. Although we're not actually on the river, we are on a little side channel in the woods. All of this gravel was moved in during the high water and it's ripe for the picking. So come with us, let's see what we can find. All right, here it is. We just pulled it out. That is ginormous. All right, I'm gonna have to clean it off and I'll show you exactly what we found here. All right, here it is, all cleaned off. You can see the bands in there and that's probably what's so exciting about this one is there's quite a bit of banding in there. That's beautiful. All right, now we have a really special find right here. Look at that beautiful treasure state agate. Wow. So Alina just found that one. All right, we got a couple agates here. Ooh, this one has some beautiful bands in it. Now, if any of you have been following the saga of my spray bottle woes, I actually, wow, look at that. That's really pretty. Oh, oh my gosh, are you kidding me? That is beautiful. Just got bit by a mosquito. That is incredible. <laughs> okay, now over here is our next. Right here, you see it. It's, it's kind of an unusual one. I think this is more of a milk agate. Alina gave me a heads up on this one. But geez, guys, can you believe? Can you believe this little one? That feeling when you turn it around and you see those bands. Oh my gosh, that is just incredible <laughs> another find from miss agate angler over there hello i know she doesn't really make very many appearances she found this nice little water line nodule though that's pretty it is so beautiful back here in the woods all right we made it down to the river and as I was saying about the water bottle, we actually left it back at our last spot. So now we're gonna have to wash everything off by hand, starting with this guy. Look at that big old agate. <laughs> All right, we'll take that on down to the river, get it cleaned up here, and then we'll get our water bottle on the way back. Check that out. That is just beautiful. And here's another little one I found on my way over here to where we're swimming. Check out the little bands on there. And last, but certainly not least, is this agate that Alina found. Really pretty. And it's Labor Day. 
we've done a little walking. You can see our backpacks way over there. The girls are having fun over here though in the mud. Helena, meanwhile, finds all the stuff. Ooh, this looks like a nice waterline agate. Let's go get that wet. All right, let's check this out. Ooh, baby, look at that thing. That is beautiful. You can see the water line starting on this side here. It goes all the way through over there until it looks like that. That is stunning. What a beautiful find. So I was starting to mention, today's Labor Day. We are out in the morning for a hunt out here. And this evening, I'm taking the kayak out for a, uh, a float down the same section, but I'm gonna hit some different gravel bars. So I think if all goes well, this is gonna be part one of two hunts today on Labor Day. All right, and here's our last find. We just, we're headed back towards the car and I pulled this out of the ground. It's got a really pretty quartz pocket there. All right, well, that's gonna do it for us today. Lydia, did you have a good time? Yeah. We had a great time rock hunting. And again, I'm planning to go out on the river tonight to do even a little bit more. So I thanks for watching. Yes, you found some agates. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll see you again next time.